We still do not have everything or anything that we need for our Halloween costume. Spirit, this holds all of our like makeup. I thought we were gonna have to like DIY it and it never covers well. I am not good at applying eyelashes. <laughs> she says neither is she, so hopefully it's not a film. The guy on the front of the cover is kind of scary looking. <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another Vlogtober video. I cannot believe Vlogtober is almost finished. Like we're almost at Halloween. Right now we're actually sitting in the car and we're about to go inside Spirit Halloween to pick up our costumes or part of our costumes. We still do not have everything or anything that we need for our Halloween costumes except mom. She has basically everything but a few items. I have nothing, Briley has nothing. Aiden already has his entire costume. So so he is good to go. Trying to figure out what I want to be for Halloween has been like really stressful. I always wait until the last minute because I just do not know. We're gonna go in here and see what they have. Also, we have to pick up Charlie and Charlotte's costumes today because I think we finally know what they're going to be. Yeah, that's basically what today's gonna be. We're gonna go shopping for Halloween stuff. So, subscribe down below if you're excited and let's go. Did not vlog in spirit. Reason being is the music was ridiculously loud. But we are now at Goodwill to go finish finding our Halloween attire. The reason being is I just personally do not want to spend like an arm and a leg just for a Halloween costume that we're only going to wear once like really so I think it's awesome to go to the thrift store instead of buying like $70 outfits from Spirit or a costume store. We're at the Goodwill and we're going to try to find us something. I'm pretty sure we are and I already have like what I need. I haven't even told y'all what I'm being yet. <laughs> But once I get home, I will do like a haul of what we bought and I will explain to you what I'm going to be. But we did find a few things at Spirit that we did need. I found like the hairspray, the colored hairspray because they didn't have the colors I needed at Walmart. But we are going to go back to Walmart because one of the cans that I need is there. So <laughs> we're going like all over the world about our costume, but it's okay. So I'm going to go into the thrift store. We're going to go do some thrift store shopping. So we've made it to Walmart. This is a preview of our cart so far. Once we get home, like I said, I'll do a haul for you guys. We're on the hunt for a striped shirt for Briley's costume. She's going to be Chucky. We're trying to find that shirt. And if we can, we also have to find overalls. I forgot about that. So we're gonna keep looking, see what we can find here. The Halloween section is still pretty full. So we'll keep you updated if we find the striped shirt. Fingers crossed we do. Okay, so we are back home now and we did not really have any luck. I'm having the hardest time finding the actual costume that I need for what I'm dressing up as. I haven't even told you what I'm being. So Briley's going as Chucky and it's been difficult trying to find the pieces that she needs because we're trying to like DIY our costumes. That's what we always do and they always turn out really cute. Trying to find the items that we need this year has been difficult. For my costume, I'm actually going as Beetlejuice this year. I saw the movie for the first time, I saw the makeup and I was like, you know what? That makeup's really cute so I kind of want to be Beetlejuice. So that's what the plan is. I will show you the haul of everything that I got for my costume. The only thing is, I actually don't have the clothing for it. So that's what I'm gonna be on the hunt for tomorrow because that's really the only day we have left because Thursday's Halloween. Kind of stressing out, I'm not gonna be able to find what I need in time. We'll see. Right now I'm in the process of cooking dinner or finishing it up, I should say. We're having honey mustard chicken, which was cooked in the crock pot, corn and mashed potatoes. And while we eat, we're gonna watch the new Chucky movie that came out. We've already seen it like twice and it was so good, but the rest of the family hasn't seen it yet. So we're gonna sit down, watch that, and then we're actually gonna go run through our closets and see if we have anything that could work for both of our costumes. Okay, gonna do a haul real quick of everything that we got for Halloween. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is what we got from Goodwill, which is Riley's red and white striped shirt. Not sure if we're gonna go with a different option. And then the next place I'm gonna show you is Spirit. This holds all of our like makeup stuff. Mom ended up getting this cute little mini witch hat. She's going to go as a witch this year. She's always wanted to just because the makeup's like really pretty, but we always end up doing something different but this year we're all doing our own thing most of the time we usually do like a group Halloween costume but this year we're doing something different so she's gonna be a witch this year and she didn't want the, like the big witch hat just because she was like with getting in and out of the car and just hanging around that it's probably gonna be like annoying wearing so she thought that this was the perfect option and I have a shot that they actually had these in store I thought we were gonna have to like DIY it but we don't. The next thing, color hairspray. So for Chucky, Briley obviously needs red, so she got that. And for Beetlejuice, I need green. Because my hair is so dark, we ended up going to Walmart 
and also picking up just a can of white. I saw the makeup tutorial and the girl ended up using the white first because she had darker hair also and then sprayed the green so it was more vibrant because every year I try to spray my hair it always takes like multiple cans and it never covers well so I feel like this option, the white will give the green something to hold on to. Mom also got some glitter hairspray just to look all cute. I think this is going to be really pretty. These are actually from Walmart. We actually have all the makeup in just one bag. But we got some eyelashes. So mom ended up getting, these are the true volume eyelashes. I am not good at applying eyelashes. <laughs> she says neither is she. So hopefully it's not a film. We actually wear these. I always hate Halloween eyelashes. They're just annoying to wear honestly and they're not the most comfortable. But we're gonna try to make it work. And then I got some of these Kiss Spirit Animal ones. And the reason I went with these is because they have the purple on the bottom, which will match my eye look perfectly. So I think these are gonna look really cute. It's just the fact of if we can get them to stay on. We also just picked up some of these makeup wedges, which is basically what we're going to be applying a lot of our makeup on with. Mom found these super cute spider earrings. These are actually from Walmart, but I think these are gonna look adorable with her witch outfit. This is gonna look so cute. Then I did not even know they made this, but I wanted this just for like a Halloween makeup look. If I have time to do it before Halloween, I wanted this. And also I'm pretty sure I can use it for my whole Beetlejuice look. I picked up one of these NYX white liquid eyeliners. Like I did not even know they made this. I don't know what I was thinking. I thought the white only came in like tinsel form, but this is like the exact same type of one I have for the black eyeliner that I use all the time so really excited to have that now we also just picked up some of this red grease makeup this is for Briley's look guy on the front of the cover is kind of scary looking <laughs> then I picked up this purple lipstick I think this is going to complete the Beetlejuice look perfectly it's really pretty I also have like a Kylie lip kit that is kind of more purple so I might throw that on top of this if it's not like shiny or I might end up adding some like highlight to it just to make it really Really pop. So that's everything out of the makeup bag. Now into the Walmart bag holds all of our party stuff and some other stuff. So we're having another Halloween party which we do like every year for just us. We're not like inviting people. So I actually picked up some of these right here and they're actually like zombie hands and I think this is going to look so cute. If you can see the picture right there that's what I'm going to try to make mine look like. It looks pretty simple. I mean it's just cupcakes and then put the little sprinkles aka dirt and then the little arms coming out i think that's going to be so cute we also picked up some of these little spider hanging decorations these are going to look adorable cupcake tins black and orange straws these are really cute napkins i love these and the plates are really cute also and then we also picked up a pumpkin carving kit because we have not carved pumpkins yet we usually do that like either the day before halloween or on halloween night and then i also picked up some of these spiders that I have something really cool I'm doing with that is part of food even though you're not going to eat these obviously because these are not edible but it has something to do with one of the like little treats I'm making. You guys are going to have to come back to see everything that we do during the party and our Halloween costumes. I'm probably going to do like a get ready with me so you guys can see me transform myself into Beetlejuice. I'm really excited. I pray the makeup turns out good. You always have like this inspiration. You're trying to follow a picture and you just always have to put in mind that you're not going to look exactly like the picture. Reason being is, one, you do not have the same facial features as those people putting on their makeup, and two, I'm probably not as skilled as some of those people putting on that makeup. <laughs> but I think it's going to be easy. I have the James Charles palette. It's basically going to be my entire look. I mean, literally, the entire makeup look is happening with the James Charles palette. And then the few pieces I just bought or showed you. Yeah, I'm really excited for Halloween. I cannot believe it's tomorrow. The last Vlogtober video. Oh my goodness. I can't believe it's already coming to an end. Probably will end up staying on the same posting schedule even though it really hasn't been a schedule because I've been kind of sporadic, but I'm really going to try to stick with posting at least five to seven times a week. That is my goal because when Vlogmas comes, obviously I will be posting every day. I will not miss a day of that, but Vlogtober was something new this year and it was really fun and I can't wait to see what tomorrow's video brings for you guys. So yeah, that's everything for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. I am so excited to finish shopping for my Beetlejuice look. Obviously, I do not have everything because as I told you, we had the hardest time just trying to find the Beetlejuice shirt or blazer and the pants has been an interesting situation. I probably should have planned this out a little earlier so I could have ordered stuff, but... 
I rather DIY outfits than buy like the costume that's already in stores just because you can make it your own and it's not as expensive. So anyways, if you enjoyed today's video, give it a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Also subscribe and I will see you all tomorrow.